What's up guys, Ghostboy here to do a rapid reviews video which I've never done. So what this is, is I review more than one release in one video. This is four releases, two albums, one, no, two albums, two full lengths, two EPs. And uh, yeah, let's just get started. So starting this off is the fifth studio album by D's Nuts, You Got Me Fucked Up. Um, Ten tracks and 30 minutes in length. And oh, and also, both, all releases are were released on October 18th. Just point that out. Now, I feel like this album was kind of a step up from their previous one, Binge and Purgatory, which is an absolute banger. These Nuts is definitely one of the bands that got heavier with each album, and the riffs for the, on this one are, you know, they pretty much prove that. But I'm very salty that these guys are unknown here in the U.S. Not for those of you that don't know, these Nuts are huge in Europe and Australia, but here in North America, like, no one knows who they are. But, Hopefully that'll change, because these guys are the shit. And, yeah, I just love this album, man. It's just... It's just a good sing-along, you know? That's that's it. The next album I'll be talking about is the debut full-length from Prison, Still Alive. Eight tracks, 30 minutes long. Mid-October was definitely the best time of the year for this album to be released due to how eerie-sounding it is. Especially when you got songs like You, Me, and The Devil, which is just fucking, so fucking scary. But then again, Prison in general has always been an eerie sounding band. You know, their debut EP had, it, ugh. Uh, we're not editing that, we're not going to edit that out. Their debut EP had a lot of scary shit, but this album is just, ugh. The best way I can describe this album is if you take a bunch of lost episodes of Goosebumps, if there is any. And then write songs about them. Thank you, Prison, for scaring the shit out of us, but also giving us a nice bitch slap, too. Now, without further ado, let's get on to the EPs. The first EP I'm going to be talking about is the second EP by Shame Spiral. Wow, these guys really need to make a damn full length. This EP is seven minutes long with only three tracks. Shame Spiral is easily one of the like, hardest up and coming metalcore bands of the late 2000s. Although Bailey's vocals sounded harsher on their previous EP, The Solace and Suffering, he still sounds like he had a bad day at the carnival and decided to write about it. That's kind of the feel of this whole EP. Really punishing shit right here. I also love that they had the opportunity to feature Vincent Bennett on a fucking track, man. Like, these guys literally just started releasing music last year and now they get Vincent Bennett to do a guest vocal, to do guest vocals on one of their songs. Like, just... Yeah, these guys are going to blow up. They're going to come far here in the hardcore community. And last but not least, I'm about to talk about the debut EP from Wellwisher, Eternal Peace. Six tracks, 15 minutes in length. Now, I'm very new to these guys. I recently found about found out about them a few weeks ago. And I got to say, I like what I'm hearing. They kind of sound like a cross between Unearth and Varials. It's amazing. Like, this shit goes hard. But anyway, let's talk about track number three, Sorrow. Sorry, I'm going, going Sorrow here. Entirely different from every other song on here. It's like a lo-fi hip-hop track that, in a way, la acts like an intermission between Burden and Hollow. Where it's like, you're all pumped up after listening to Burden. And then this comes on, and you're, uh, you're all relaxed. Maybe fall asleep a bit. But then Hollow comes on and you get your punk ass woke. Yeah, but just this EP as a whole is an absolute banger. And that's all I gotta say. Hope you guys enjoyed this Rapids review. I'm probably gonna... I might be doing that for the rest of the year. Because um, with a lot of days that are... That have music coming out, there's like more than one. But we'll see. Uh, hope you liked... Hope you liked this shit. Hope you liked these releases. Let me know. And see you in the next video.